Hey everyone, GameplayVids247 here. Welcome back to my Equinox gameplay walkthrough series for the PC. Straight away guys, I want to say thank you all so much for the fantastic support you all gave the first episode. I was not expecting that dude. We're almost up to 100 likes on it. I have not had a video like this since Clicker Heroes 2 was released and that was like four months ago. So thank you all so much for tuning in. It's going to be another long episode guys, so please be sure to grab your coke, your drink, whatever the hell you like to drink and eat. Uh, and yeah, get ready for a 45 minute or so episode, okay? Hopefully you watch it all, I really would appreciate it. Let's kick it off now, dude. We're jumping straight back in. So, I have some ideas, okay? I'm gonna make a tree area up here. The grass is spread throughout this area here to create a nice, a nice path by the looks of it, very cool. I'm thinking this area will be where the ducks will hang out and the chickens. I did find out, thanks to you amazing viewers out there, that you can actually find what species dislikes another. And the way you can do that is going onto like the little uh, species tab, clicking on the eye, and then going to habitat. It was there the whole time, I just did not read it because I'm blind apparently. So yeah, that's a little interesting fact. Now what we can do is breed some ducks, so I reckon we'll do that straight away here. Duck, uh, start breeding, done. So I want to quickly fast forward as we're breeding the duck. Hopefully my chicken does not die while we're breeding here. We'll find out in a second. No, that's all done. Awesome. So what's this? Is this a duck egg? I hope so. Let's have a look. That is a duck. Awesome, dude. We finally have a new species here uh, in the game, which is the duck. That's a great way to start the episode off, hey? Now, just fast forwarding a bit here so we can generate some more DP. Is that duck about to hatch? I reckon it is. Isn't it? Oh no, it's only 25% grown. Wow. And apparently, oh no, there it is. Hey, look, he's in the water. He's under the water right now. I hope you're not drowning. Nah, you're all right, you'll be fine. Little duck, cool. Um, it likes eating kelp, by the way. Okay, so we do have kelp in this little riverbed here, I hope. Um, what I can do is actually plant some more if need be. Kelp's 950 DP though, quite expensive actually, isn't it? Uh, duck, 4,870. We'll throw that down right there. We'll just chuck down another duck, everyone. Hopefully we can start multiplying the ducks. More breeds the better, of course, when it comes down to it. What I'm scared of is when we eventually get to predators. So what happens when the ducks start getting hunted or the chickens start getting hunted, you know what I mean? A bit scary, but we'll find out eventually either way. Now we do have a nice little sheep area up here. Can we breed these into something else yet? I don't think so, not at the moment. Um, satisfied duck. Have two duck in the world with an environmental satisfaction of over 75%. Well, you should be over the 75%, shouldn't you? Environment 65% right now. Maybe it needs more kelp, perhaps? I mean, that's a program I'm thinking. Maybe you need more kelp to eat. So we we'll throw down some more kelp here. Now, do you like rocks or anything, Mr. Duck? That's probably something I should check out as well. Just in case. You never know with these guys. Like species, water plants and trees. But the chickens don't like trees, so that's a problem. I can't really throw down the trees. I can put down some more daisies, maybe? Oh no, there we go, task complete, totally quackers. Nice, we got it everyone. Okay, satisfied duck mission complete. We unlocked jungle rocks and 6,000 DP. Awesome. Now what happens? That's the question. Where are my jungle rocks? There they are, jungle rocks are here. Large rocks, rock stones, non-living. Okay, game. Really liking this game, by the way. I'm not just saying that either. It's a very, very interesting game. I thoroughly am enjoying it. Uh, what else can we actually do here at the moment, though? Um, the Evolve with Buttercup is something I want to do. But I just don't know how to evolve the Buttercup properly, because I need to get, like, a jungle area, I think. I'm not too sure if that's something I can actually achieve right now. A strange chicken has been born. Where? Mischief. Its name's Mischief. That's pretty funny. So, yeah, it's an, it's an odd one. What's different about it, though? Size is a bit bigger, maybe? No. Oh, it might be, actually. Size might be a little bit different. But the colours are all the same, aren't they? Or is it an odd colour? Perhaps it's an odd colour. That, that must be it. Well, we'll hatch soon, anyway. I'm fast-forwarding. There it is. Yeah, it is a complete odd colour. Nice. That's pretty cool, dude. Good old mischief. Alright, well, how are we looking up here? Find out. Swamp. 
Jungle. That was still not jungle right now. That has nothing to do with it. The jungle uh, rocks have nothing to do with it, guys. I mean, there's stones I can throw down. I still won't really make it jungle, though. Throw down a rock. Grassland, 91%. Here we go, baby. Size trait's not 1.5. Damn it! It's not big enough grass. Really? All small grass. I need a big grass, everyone. Oh, and it died. It just disappeared. I want to try and keep evolving new plants if I can. Nearby species, mushrooms times two in color trait, mud green. That's oregano. Oh, was that oregano? Sorry, oregano. <laughs> oregano. I think it is oregano. I mean, it might be. Who knows? This little area here. What's going on up here? Nothing, okay? It's not jungle or whatever. 50% jungle. Still counted as grassland. Okay, well, I'm not too sure then just yet on how to actually get that achieved. Light blue and tropical. Swamp red. I don't think we have a swamp land yet at all, do we? What about the oak trees? Can they evolve? Apple tree. Skymore tree, is it? An elm tree. Woodland trees. Woodland trees, biome. They're all woodland trees, okay. We have a lot of chickens right now, though. Birch tree. Provides a nesting spot for birds. Grassland trees. Small tree which can grow in almost any grassy areas. A lovely addition to a grassland biome. Okay, well, we don't have one yet, so we might as well put one down here, hey? I know the ducks hate them, but that's okay. Who cares about the ducks for now? <laughs> This area out here is concerning me a lot. We should probably throw something else down here. A guinea pig woodland biome. Grassland, barren land, riverbed. See, I don't have any swamp land though, do I? No, no kind of swamp. Not too sure on how to create a swamp land just yet. That's the only problem. They have five tropical seaweed in the world. Once you've unlocked tropical plants, well no, I don't have tropical plants, that's any problem. I don't think, anyway. Unsuitable biomes, swamp, lights, rocks. Interesting. Water lily. What am I gonna do here, everyone? We might be in some trouble, because I don't know what the hell to do now. Can we evolve the wheat into something? Probably not. No, we cannot. Wild mint, 85% grassland. That should be out here, surely. Wild mint. This is heavy grassland, I know that much for sure. But now we just need that size trait increased. Not 1.5. Trust my luck, guys. The one thing we need, hey? All right, where's some new grass going here? Selected breed. Increase the size. Increase by... Let's go 7%. Let's try and grow that 7% increase in grass size. Hopefully that works out well. Like the breed. Should start growing the ones around at one point. Yeah, one times five. Is it close enough to the grass though? That's the thing. No, 85% grassland. See, it's still not close enough to the grassland. That's the problem, bro. What I need to do is grow more grass around here. Make a heavy grassland. That shouldn't be too hard, right? There we go. Now we got a lot of grass everywhere. Okay. Now I just need to find big enough. This is 98 down here, guys. Size tray, we just need a big size. If we can. How about this, if I go selective? Let's buy here, quickly. Hopefully we'll grow something big. Ideally. One times four, one times seven. Wild mint, finally got the wild mint, guys. Great. I'm just gonna try and breed the wild mint. Evolving pause, fantastic, dude. Continue evolving, great.
Yes, done. Okay, I've got wild mint now for the first time. Nice. Hopefully it grows naturally. Maybe. We'll find out together here. Oh, looks like grass around here. Yes, it is. All grass. Uh, where are you? Wild mint. Herbs, small plants, plants, grassland biome. Suitable. Grassland, lush and tropical. Okay. Throw down the wild mint. All down here. Just to watch it grow. Hopefully spread out everywhere. Great stuff. Okay, that's working well. Just realized we don't have enough sheep, guys. Maybe we should put down some more sheep. There we go. Put down a whole family of sheep. They should all grow now big and strong. Hopefully, if all goes well. Just going to generate some more DP, I hope. Now, I really want to know how to make the grassland and stuff. This little grassland. It's riverbed, mainly. I want swamp land. I just don't know how the hell to make the swamp land just yet. What about the buttercup from the daisy? That might be the next thing as well. I just want to keep trying to go through everything and evolve everything that I can. The swamp grass requires task oh dear. Lush grass. Jungle plant. What about jungle grass game? Come on. Grasses. Here we go. Barley, swamp grass, jungle grass. That's what I want. A bird in the hand. Where do we get that from? A bird in the hand. I guess what I can try and do is the seaweed population and the clownfish population, hey? Do we put in this little area here or the big pool area down here? I reckon we'll go down here, everyone. What do you think? So can we try and do something here? Kelp and water lily. What about the kelp? Can I do something with the kelp? Tropical seaweed. There we go. Tropical seaweed with the kelp. Cool. 50% uh, tropical and large rocks times two. I do not have a tropical area, though. That's the only problem. What about a birch tree or something, or an oak tree? Can I change the oak tree into something, perhaps? Grassland, forest, and woodland. Doesn't like the desert, though, the oak tree. Right, I'll throw some trees down here. Speed up time. Speeding up the time, guys. And see if I can evolve anything, po if possible, anyway. Trees are hopefully coming through here. Yes, they are. Here we go, I can get another tree. Sycamore tree, okay, that's different. What about some sheep or something down here as well? Probably diversify the area maybe. Or perhaps some ducks. I can just throw down ducks directly now, can't I? Don't even have to worry about breeding the chickens. That's fine. Awesome. That tree is now... Yes, unlocked. See, species evolved. Sycamore tree. Sycamore, I think it is. I hope so, anyway. Now, with the actual sheep, can I evolve these guys into something? Wild boar, fallen fruit, and grassland. Minus 10 grassland. Goat, above 50 meters, 35% snow, 70% woodland, and fruit bushes for the deer. Okay, we need fallen fruit and 10% grassland. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So if I put a sheep down here, it's all dry land, barren land. What about this tree here? Environment, what do you like? Hopefully that keeps going up. I do hope so. It's not even grown yet, is it? This little tree? It's slowly growing. Just not too sure about what kind of environment it likes. It turned into a nut tree, apparently. Okay. Chicken has caught disease. Oh no! Where? This little guy. They're all dying. Gotta get rid of them. Remove. Remove. Nice. Okay. Really love watching everything to come together here, by the way. It's pretty sweet, dude. What's this one? Woodland tree. Habitat. Woodland forest. Like species herbs. Provides nesting spot. Right, so it's not really gonna like this area, pretty much. At all. That is a bit of a problem. If I move him away from the water, transplant. Probably down here, I think. Probably better off choice anyway. And it fell and died straight away. Okay. I really hope that grows back. I don't think it did. I think it died straight away then. I unlocked the species, but I couldn't save it, everyone. 
Where the hell are my daisies? This is probably the next thing I actually have to try and, uh, you know, diversify. I haven't done the daisy jet either. Where are you, little daisy? I haven't seen a lot of them anymore. There's a daisy. We get tulip. Grassland, light blue, color trait. All right, let's do that one, light blue. Done. Now, next one that grows will be light blue, ideally. Let's find out. I really do hope so. It better spread and create a light blue one, I'll be pissed. You get to see a light blue one. I think I've been screwed over here. Light blue, bye. Light blue, bye. Okay, now it should work, definitely. I want to see, is it gonna grow it? I swear to God, it better grow it. There's one there, I think. Yes, there is one, tulip. Done, start breeding. Awesome! Okay. That's it, successfully evolved the tulip. Okay. And go bluebell and rose as well. Bluebell, small plants, snow biome apparently, okay. Snow biome everyone. What about this one here, grassland biome. Spreads through there. Suitable, forest, woodland, snow. Okay, what about the buttercup? Buttercup, yellow trait. Alrighty. Try and get one that's about to grow, I think. It's probably the best one for us to do. The other one's about to sprout up, I think. There's one there. Selective. Yellow. Done. Okay, let's see if this works, everyone. I hope it does. Tulip there. Is that the yellow one? Purple. Red. Buttercup's what I'm going for, a yellow one. Should hopefully see it grow around here, ideally. I haven't seen a yellow one yet. Oh, there is one. Awesome. Gonna get the buttercup now. Great. That's just evolving there. Very good for me. There's more of them popping up now. How cool is that? Done, got it. Species evolved, task complete, diversifies, done. Nice, evolved buttercup. Yeah, it's done everyone. You've unlocked the rosemary species. You have unlocked two tasks. Okay, so that's done there. Very nice. So we've got rosemary now, herbs, forest biome, spreads throughout the forest biome. Okay, unsuitables, desert, snow, swamp, tropical, barren land, grassland, forest and woodland. That's for rosemary. Rosemary is the most basic forest plant in the equinox. It can be used to start creating a forest ecosystem. This fragrant herb grows best when surrounded by trees. While, and while it prefers fertile areas, it's also able to grow in barren land. It cannot grow too close to water. Alrighty. Awesome. Apples eaten. Zero one. Okay. Sink more tree in the world. One of three. Let's put more in then. Where is that tree? No requirement. Think more, there we go. Now what area does this like? Hopefully down here. It better, I'll be pissed. Probably the altitude that's gonna kill these trees, by the way. That's all right, we just we need, we need them planted, pretty much. And actually alive. They better not all die, I'll be so pissed, by the way. They better stay alive, these trees. Better keep growing. Growth, 34%. Why? Why is it not growing? What's happened here? What's its uh, altitude it needs? It likes woodland, that's why. Woodland biome. Woodland and forest. You need to put a whole bunch of rosemary around here. That'll create the forest biome, wouldn't it? If I am correct. Rosemary's growing. Lots of rosemary's growing. Trees are much more happier now, aren't they? All green, bro. That's right. That should be a forest biome then. It is too, 57% forest biome. There you have it. Great stuff, okay. Now we have a forest area growing in the middle of the screen here. Down here, this life's taking over still. Everything's continuing on without me even touching it. That's what I like to see, dude. How about down here now? Hmm. Uh, red maple, these are trees. Oregano in the world. Oregano, I think it's oregano, and elm tree in the world, okay. Oregano. 
What do I need to do to unlock that? Grass turf. Devolves from the grass. Oregano. Nearby species. Mushrooms times two. Color trait. Mud green. Okay, so mushrooms times two. That's there. Mud green. Done. Bye. Okay, so I just purchased that. This should work, theoretically, right? Just the new grass has to grow. Color. That's not mud green, that's not mud green. They're all the same. Selective. Mud green. Bye. Try again. Hopefully this works. Just keep an eye out for mud green. That'd be it there. Done. Start breeding. Cool. Breeding oregano. Is that it? We've done it? Yes, we have. Find that down here. Wait, where does this side to be planted? I don't even actually know right now. Oregano. Woodland biome. That'd be better down here, wouldn't it? Elm tree in the well. We need to put down some elm trees. Okay, elm tree, evolves from oak tree, nut tree, can I turn that into a nut tree? Oak tree, apple tree, make an apple tree, Let's start bringing an apple tree, we don't have one of them yet, we need a woodland area here, okay, this isn't a woodland area, okay, this is the woodlands only 29%, Interesting, woodland 31%. Elm tree, I can do that here though. Who knows bro, I can, I can breed two different things, apple and elm tree. Very interesting to me. Hopefully this works, I really do hope it does work. Tree's red. What's happened, it's paused. Is it woodland, not 30? Maybe, I don't know. Apple tree's about to be done though. The yeah, apple tree's done. Successfully bred an apple tree. Cool. I don't know what the hell's going on with this tree here. Still paused. Interesting. Down some more oak trees there then. Just to continue on the, the breeding if I need to. From 12,000 DP right now, guys. I'm actually waiting on this tree to die. Health, pretty low health, that's good. Gotta wait for it to pass out and die so we can actually continue the breeding somewhere else. Everything's going well down there. Still heaps of sheep around here, which is good. Still is not dead though. Progress. Take over evolving. There we go. Done. All right. All good. Got the other trees to take over the evolving process. That's paused as well now. Requirements not met. So still not on the woodland area. I don't know if it's because the the sheep keep eating it or what. What creates more woodland? Let's have a look. Rosemary. Forest biome. That's it. It's done. Almost. Almost. Yes, done. Elm trees completed. That's going to go right down here. I can't actually click on it right now though because I can't see it. So rotate around. Got good health as well, which is excellent for us. Okay, awesome. Everything's going well for us here, guys. Legit. So I'm just thinking, what else can we do? We have all these different types of flowers and stuff, grass. Crazy, man. Just trying to get this challenge complete now, though. Elm tree population's only one. Can I throw out another one straight away? Elm tree, yes I can. Done, task completed. 18,000 DP, three tasks, and unlock a guinea pig. All done, guys, fantastic. Guinea pig. Small herbivores, herbivores, animals. Uh, eat fallen fruit, vegetables, nuts, fruit, bushes, herbs, grasses. 
Uh, likes being below 55 meters. Doesn't have any dislikes really, just the, the altitude. That should be fine. Bring around the guinea pigs now. There we go, a whole bunch of guinea pigs. Look at these little guys. <laughs> no worries. So we can fast forward now. There are little guinea pigs running around, they're all happy. Everything's going well. Next task, apple eaten. Well, nothing's eaten an apple yet. The apple tree's down here. Bring another apple tree down here, which is good. Pretty sure we need a boar to eat the apple, don't we? Oh no, the guinea pigs ate the apple. Fantastic, man. Main rewards, 8,500 DP. Unlock two tasks, unlock tall tree. Done. Satisfied wild boar, carrot eaten, satisfied deer. Apples reduce, 4%. Potatoes eaten, pigging out. Tropical, we still need tropical stuff, which we don't have. We legit still do not have tropical stuff, everyone. Rosemary, what can that turn into? Heather. Uh, good way to spread the forest biome in low altitudes. Okay, what else can we get out of it? Fern. Fern, spreads forest biome. Okay, get a fern and a sage. Forest biome again, so that's all forest. Rosemary. The heather again. I don't care about that anymore. Okay, very cool. Can a guinea pig turn into something else? A rabbit and a squirrel. It's pretty cool. What do I need to do for this? Ash tree and satisfaction 85%. We've well, got $35,000 right now, guys. What should I do with it, you reckon? More guinea pigs or try and get wild boars? I know the wild boar will have to be out here, won't it? We'll put a sheep out here. Wild boar, fallen fruit. It needs a fallen fruit out here. That means I need an apple tree out here, don't I? I just don't know how the hell it's going to grow. Won't it die straight away, theoretically? I'll put some grass down, maybe. Grasslands, 8%. 6% there. Grasslands, minus 10%. If that tree grows, we should be okay. That's if it grows. I don't know if the apple tree will grow or not. Grasslands getting pretty heavy around here. 23% already. Oh my god, it's spreading everywhere. That's what I do not want. I don't want grasslands spreading everywhere. I want it nearby this uh, apple tree. Grassland, 5%. That's good. That's better. Grandma fish have caught disease. That's not good. They get rid of them straight away. Remove, remove. Done. They're all gone. What's going on out here now? My little idea. My little plan, guys. Trying to get a little apple tree growing. Is it working out right now? An apple every day task is completed. Cool. Okay, so I've got a task complete. Let me just see if this plan works. Wait for this tree to bloody grow. Almost at 50%. Taking so long though to grow this apple tree. Alright, so the apple tree is at 100% growth. Let me just try and remove the grassland around here. See if this works, everyone. I really do hope it does. What's grassland now? 36%, not good. Gotta get rid of all this grass. Hopefully some apples actually grow or drop here. Grassland now, 16%, 14%. Remove, there's some apples growing on the tree. Let's remove the grass. Ideally this should work, right? We just need apples to drop. Wild boar, fallen fruit. There's some fallen fruit. Can I control it? Let's go, take control. Fallen fruit diet, still not complete. Requirements not met. Saying the requirements are still not met for the wild boar. Well, it's weird to me, everyone. I've got the fallen fruit here, but I still can't get the wild boar to eat or to, I guess, yeah, evolve. It says fallen fruit needed, but we do have fallen fruit here. Sheep's about to eat the fallen fruit. Yeah, nah, I still can't evolve them, though. Which is very weird. 
I mean, usually the requirements would say ticked, but the blind wouldn't work. Who knows, man, my idea didn't work just for now. But that's all right, either way, we're still expanding our base here. We have 78,000 DP. Just gotta figure out what the hell to do with it. Apples reduced, 5,000 DP, done. Okay, satisfy wild boar. Using the evolution system to unlock the boar species and then create a suitable environment for a family of boars to thrive in. To unlock the boar, you will need a sheep to live in a non-grassed area where it should survive on a diet of apples, which it has been already. So let me just remove the, all the grass then, I guess. This should be it, fallen fruit. There we go, start breeding, nice. Okay, For some reason now it lets me. No problem, game, no problem at all. At least we got the breeding to happen now. Involving all, oh my god, it's paused and the sheep died out. That's not good, the actual sheep died out there. Seriously. Just keep all these bloody grass away. Boards, requirements not met. Oh, they're too small, I guess, right now. Grassland's too much again. Let's remove all the grassland. Continue evolving the boars. Good. We have another apple tree growing nearby, by the way. And now we don't have the apples around us. But the evolving's still happening. It stopped on the red. The evolving stopped on the red there. You're joking me. Is it because the grass is around? Surely. Yeah, it is too. The grass is around. That's why. Come on. Yes! We got a boar. We actually got a boar. Dude, awesome. That makes me happy as. Okay, environment's bad though. What do you need? Vegetables, potato plant, forest and swamp he likes. But he's in the wrong area completely. Transplant, take control, I'll just take control, move him away. Let's go. I'm sprinting right now, by the way. Gonna get him closer to the environment he likes, I reckon. He's running like a madman. He should like this area, right? Surely. There's all apples around here. Where's he running? He better be running back. Don't run back, dude. I think he's actually running back. The warhog's running back, everyone down here. You're kidding me, dude. You are kidding me. Suitable forest and swamp. Oh, we'll get the grassland back out here. Let's make this all forest area. Rosemary, I think it is, isn't it, that I need for forest? Or woodland, that's woodland. Forest is rosemary. Okay. Put down the mushrooms. Put down the oak trees. There we go. Let's build a new area here. I don't have any rocks though. That's probably something I need. Rocks as well. Stones. Birch trees. Just expanding our area now. Excellent. So now at least we have boars, man. That's something new to us. Never had boars before. Boars are happy apparently, which is good. We have enough apple trees here though. Just litter out the apple trees a lot here. Excellent, task complete. An apple a day, auto complete. That's an auto complete now to gather money for us. Satisfied wild boar. We need 75% satisfied wild boar. Which we should get when everything's grown, ideally. Just throwing out a whole family of wild boar. Very good for us. They should hopefully all grow and be happy now. How cool is this guy? Seriously, I love this game, man. So fun. Just waiting for the apple trees to actually grow fully. Drop those apples and everyone's happy. Boars are nice and fat here though. It's still not happy with the environment though. Like species, one of two. Now we need to do a better job with the environment. Like species, stones. I need more stone. Okay. That's a lot of stones there. Environment's going up, I hope. 
Environment is slowly going up here, I think, for the boars. Yeah, it is too. Cool. Then it drops again as well. What don't you like around here? What am I missing? I have a lot of stones. Is that a tree? What the hell is that? It likes that species, the tree. I don't think I have one of them. Where is that, everyone? Spruce tree. There it is. What's this? Evolves from tall tree. Okay, where, did, where should I put this? Forest. Okay, easy. Put down a whole bunch of tall trees. Let's try and grow them up quickly. Put a whole bunch of fish down there. We're only 2,000 DP now. That's pretty good. Okay, red maple. That's birch tree. Tall tree. Need heather and size tray. Alright, we need to get some heather now. Don't have any heather at all. We get that from the rosemary, don't we? Yes, we do. Fallen fruit times three, rocks and stones times three. Bloody hell game. That should be three there, right? Yep, alright, fallen uh, fruit. We have an apple tree around here. Here it is here. Okay. So fern, sage, heather. Fallen fruit times three. There is fallen fruit near you. Done. Okay, got the fruit. And the organism died that was carrying that out. Continue evolving. Go, go, go. Come on, game. Don't let me down here, bro. An apple every day. Organism died again. Don't have fallen fruit near me. Can't shoot the fruit out here, though. Drop all fruit. That worked. Awesome. All right. We got the heather. Okay, guys. We have heather for the first time. Water lily? No, I don't want water lily. I want the heather. Heather. There we go. Great. Fast forward. Evolve the tall trees when possible. Size trait. We need a bigger size trait. There we go. Just upgrade that. We want very tall trees here. Done. So hopefully now we grow bigger trees. We have lots of them growing around us though. One times. One times eight. Excellent. We can get that tree now. That's awesome, man. That, that makes me super happy. But it's paused, is it? No, it's not paused. Good. It just takes ages to bloody grow. Alright, rewards done. An apple a day. Cool. Just fast forwarding everything here. It's all working out, guys. I'm very happy. And that organism died. Oh dear. The one main tree died that I needed. A wild boar's been born. Okay. Different colour, I guess. Nice and bright here, at least. That's good. That'd be a nice photo, hey, right there. Fantastic. All pause. Nothing I can do now. They're all too small. 07. Wow. 08. There we go. Excellent. We're back in the game. That's it. We did it. We did it. Set a tree. Put a whole bunch of them down. Hopefully they all don't die. We'll find out together here if they're going to die or not. And hopefully the boars will be happy. Awesome. Everything's just peaceful in this game right now, isn't it, dude? The environment's not good on here, apparently. Here we go. What have I done now? I just placed heaps of these things down. Forest biome. No, likes forest. Woodland, grassland. Unlikable jungle swamp lush. Light species flowers. Lights flowers. Flowers. Put a whole bunch of daisies in here. And tulips. There we go. That should make everyone happy. Hopefully. Just need to get these boars happy. 70% happiness on the boars. Apple of days done. I just want the bloody boars to be happy already. They're at 71% happiness, the boars. I don't know how many boars I have running around. Do I have six of them or not? 
I may need to put more in. Satisfy World War, three of six. Cool, it did work. There we go. Done, we did it. Six Wild Boar Happiness. Unlock two tasks, 15,000 DP. All right, look, I'm gonna wrap it up here, everyone. What a freaking day today has been in this game. Wow, oh wow. I really do hope that you all did enjoy. Thank you all so much for tuning in to another episode of Equinox. Uh, it's been a pleasure recording for you, of course, for today. Um, I will see you all in the next couple of days for the next episode. Just remember, of course, to hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed. Uh, you'll get notified when I do post videos, okay? And of course, like, comment, do all that stuff as well. Thank you again for watching, guys. I appreciate it.